Who's not? Who really on top? Who got their own shop? The hustle don't stop. Check it, check it, check it. This is Unique Hustle. It's your boy, ECO, and I'm here with the Trio Talk. No PL Talk at that guest. Yes, sir. Number one blog in Texas is in the building. Man, what's going on? We got a special guest in there today, y'all. They don't need no introduction. These guys right here, you know, you know, they came. Man, listen, I looked at the internet one day, man. And I seen some niggas jamming, j just jumping around, having a great time. <laughs> with a, you know, and I say, what's that rap? Act? What's that say on that banner? Rap economics? Man. What the hell is going on, man? And I'm like, damn, who is that? And I, prayers was one. By, 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 I said, what the hell is going on? DJ Nightcap. These boys got a whole show. And we about to get into it, man. Thank y'all for coming on Boss Talk 101, man. Yes, sir. Thank you for having us, dog. Yes, Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We here, baby. Man, you know, I've been I've been in the game just for a couple of years, man. So, you know, um, Trio Talk, no Peel Talk, and me, you know, we, we we come in this game, you know, the Lone Rangers, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Trying to see what was going down, you know, uh, information getting stole, put on other people's blog sites. I didn't know what was going on. <laughs> I said, why they take my uh, emblem off? Why did, you know, my little old, why they take my, you know, my life, you know, the little thing I put on there. You know, we don't even know what it's called. Why they take the little thing off, man? Why they blocking mine? I, it's my stuff. And I was like, I was just so hurt, you know, and I called Trio Talk, he said, yeah, they do that all the time, man. <laughs> Call them and tell them to put it back, tell them to give your uh, respect, and you DM mm -hmm. them, and they might, they might not, you know. So this was a different world for me coming into this mm -hmm. world, you know. Mm -hmm. It's become a thing where everybody is now trying to figure it out, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, and so when I got in this game, you know, I really, really was like, damn, you know what I'm saying, it's going down, but I don't know you know, I know I'm going to handle it. I ain't going to get out this hoe. I ain't letting this hoe go. So now you got Boss Talk 101. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? People call. We appreciate you for the culture and all that. I get all that. But, you know, really, I didn't see none of that coming. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So when I looked over there at Charles, it was a delight to see some brothers that was working. I look at it as work. You know it what I'm saying? Is, it is and work. Because I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, first of all, I look at it, A, from my youth perspective, that they get to do something with a good group of men that, that they, it may help save somebody's life. You know, mm -hmm. somebody spending time in your life may save that one's life. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. You see what I'm saying? So for you guys to be putting that work in, it's helping no matter how you look at it. Yeah. So kudos to y'all for figuring that Appreciate out. That. You, you know what I'm saying? Thank you. So And I know y'all ain't thought about it because y'all ain't deep like me. You ain't thought about that like <laughs> that. Y'all just like, we just rapping with these niggas. No, you know we, no we, <laughs> hey, it was it was deep, but just on a different, from a yeah. different yeah, aspect. Like we, we definitely wanted to do something for Southern hip hop. We definitely, <laughs> definitely wanted to provide a place where people could come and express themselves, show their talents, you know what I'm saying? Market themselves. Mm -hmm. And that's what's been happening. <laughs> well, you already, you were already DJing and everything? Oh yeah, I had been DJing. Yeah. How long you been DJing? What year is this? Twenty twenty three. Yes, sir. Twenty one years now. Wow, twenty one years. I had to do the math in my head. Yeah, yeah. I had a first. Yeah, radio station. He been. Yeah, I had a. I had a platform that I had on three or four different FM stations. Throw it in the game podcast. I had throw it in the game podcast. I had the Breaking Texas radio show, and then I was I was also running a DJ coalition on the podcast. Why you didn't keep it going? Um, man, you have to talk to my partner on that. You know you're, what I'm saying? I, no question. Man, that's why I said no question. You talk you to no comment. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. It's <laughs> love. That nigga no it's comment. Love. It's, it's yeah. love, but you know things happen. The Throw in the Game podcast is different than rap economics. Yeah, 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 it's different. We started this together. I was brought in on that. Mm, you know what okay. I'm saying? Yeah, so a difference. once I came in, we saw a change on it, and things grew. But I, that was something I was brought in on, and we made it work. Wow. This something me and him yeah, started Yeah, we 50-50 on this. Mm -hmm. I was a fan of his platform. I used to bring artists to his platforms. That's how we met. That's how we met. We did good business. I just, you know, I've always been a fan of the culture. I always wanted to see brothers win, so I've been a fan of his platform since forever. Man, you know, how important is it to work with the person that you have that chemistry with? Mm. I know we, we find those those... It's like an equilibrium being on point. You Super know what I'm saying? Super valuable. That's the best. It, would, it wouldn't work if it didn't work. You know what I'm saying? Because it's too much to talk about. It's too mm -hmm. much you're going to disagree on. It's too much you're going to, I don't know how he going to feel, but let's go find out. You know what I'm saying? So 
it wouldn't work if it wouldn't work. I don't you think nobody saying? touching him when it comes to putting out content. We drop content every day. What the hell you mean? We dropping content every Ooh. day. You know what I'm saying? Hey, yeah. Yeah. He we dropping a lot of content. I mean, you going to be my boy. You tell me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he is dropping my soul. I feel man. like I'm working with the best. You know what I'm saying? Which I don't really take lightly to that. <laughs> I, I just don't see y'all dropping what I'm dropping like that, bro. No way. What'd you say? He don't drop as much as you. Nah, hell mean? no. You, I'm dropping seven, yeah. eight a day. No, we drop a piece of content. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He we dro- no, but we I'm dro- interviewing. You see, I mean, I mean, we just see, did. Yeah, we, we done did five interviews a day, right? But that's how we run our setup too. I just yeah. never seen we nobody out, work like him. We knock out umpteen well, in a day. You ain't been around me. Hey, that's your biggest <laughs> damn problem. Yeah, yeah. You know, you know, we, so. we similar though. When we go at it, we knock out umpteen in a day. Though. What's the most you done in a day? Twenty three. Y'all some beasts. We once did so twenty three a day. We was there about eight hours Ooh, no, man. recording that day. Man, I, I was there. Voice gone. I couldn't even say, everybody came. You couldn't even hear it no more. I did that in Atlanta. <laughs> when I, 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 did, I did 14, <laughs> but I'm doing an hour long. <laughs> I did 14 hours. See, with us, one, some, you know. And it's different subjects and different people. I was in Atlanta, Georgia. Mm-hmm. The Reds are showing this person, that yeah, person, be, Fred Hampton Jr. It. This uh, go. Hey, it, that's, uh, that's why I be like, watching though, because you be on it, dog. Yeah, yeah, you, you be, be on it. Like he's saying, I be on it. Yeah. I respect niggas that yeah, be on yeah, it. Like yeah, I be yeah, on yeah, it. Yeah, I'm you definitely, be on it. I definitely late at night. I watch the show constantly. I keep something. I drop a two. Now I, I watch three full episodes. I watch today. your shit while I'm editing. That's all. No so who do the all the editing for y'all? Go. This the beast. Beast. We do all the just like everything, the everything you see on the internet. Yeah, mm. be the same way. So yeah, CD Cam, man, same thing. It's I, not a game. I, so that's I, how I, y'all make it work. Cause well, you no. do one part, he do the other part. I do the man, book and he do the he, editing. He take he take yeah. the administration shit off my hands. Yeah. I get to sit back and be the visionary. So he like the of, office and you the worker. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. That's that. See, that's no. We together, baby. We cook the work. He sell the work. That's how it go. That's how it go right there. Yeah, that's how I cook the work. He sell the work. Nah, why? Nah, I think you guys the dope man. Like you guys, basically, who's the? I mean, y'all. I I I've seen Boosted daughter on y'all. We had Poison Ivy. I want to say that. One she, of the hardest episodes y'all She had. was our first she was real hard. viral, yeah. major viral, national. Every you know. time they... I, I mean, wanna, it's one of the biggest... You can remember that, though. We did about... I we, mean, it's millions and millions. We did about 17 million on that one. That whole went crazy. Yeah, yeah. Was, it, did, it went crazy. We did about 17 million on that. Who so. would y'all say y'all best one was? We oh, wait, y'all not your best, but I'm, your favorite. Your favorite. Mm. It's, it's just too many. See, once I get to start naming names, you know how people going to start acting. But, yeah, it's too many. But I'm a I'm gonna do it like this. Don't Cal- do it. Don't do it. Don't okay. do it. Okay. Don't do it. Okay. <laughs> do not do it. Do not do it. So hers went the most viral though. Yeah, that's the most viral. That was the most viral. I mean yeah. it was it was so the many. Biggest viral. How about that? Hers it was, was the biggest viral. It was reposted so much. What it made was, it go viral? What y'all think made it go viral? The performance. The yeah. performance and who she was? Yeah. She the performance. That, she hit that whole. She, it she nailed she it. Hit that and then when they was like, "Oh, Boosie daughter," that helped. Yeah. yeah. And, mm. I'm gonna tell and, you um, something though. Once, once Timberland reposted, oh, yeah, it was crazy. It was over. It was over with. It was over after Timberland posted. That wasn't the song that she was gonna do, or that wasn't. She wasn't gonna use that beat. She was gonna do another. We played that. We listened, and we was like, "I want you to come with that. We want you to come with the bars. Mm-hmm. No harmonizing the bars." And she was like, she said this in a Louisiana accent, oh, you want me to go dumb? And I was like, yeah. And she went dumb. Go dumb. That's all. I'm going to be honest, I was really doing the freestyle thing. Y'all stole that from me. <laughs> I, mean, I, think I, so. I was doing that before y'all. You think so? Bro, let's go by date. It's, it's, it's niggas think we stole that date. shit from them. And I I'm like, nah, I can go by the date, bro. Go ahead. I can go back to the date, bro. You know I was doing that for them, bro. But you wasn't saying it like that, that everybody can't come up here. They no, took, that wasn't my thing. That makes, I was that the ticket, it man. Bigger. It's different. I don't think it is. I'm just saying, I had that. Y'all stole that from me. And it's cool. <laughs> but just be real. Give me my props. You know what I'm saying? Just give me my props. You definitely, as a I platform, had the rappers up here rapping, freestyling before y'all. Y'all took so my style. So why don't you style. do verses? 
What really? Do a verse? I, and Sway, he got it from me. You know who I looked up to? You know what I'm saying? I'm Sway. Saying, I, that's not, I could tell you where the inspiration for us came from. I'm just giving y'all here. I can tell you where it came from, probably. Who you flex? No, Funk Master Flex. No, Flex. No. He, said that, he said that everybody can't uh, come up here. Well, he said it a few times. Uh, yeah. It's kind of like the Jay-Z shit. somebody else, yeah. though. You made it a hot line. I'm going to be honest with you. Y'all look a lot like Famous Animal TV. I told him the same thing about y'all. Well, hold on. Cut to the chase. We can cut to the chase. I'm Okay. I said the same thing about y'all that I said about him. Now I'm saying it to y'all. Okay, but let me tell y'all you look this. look a lot alike, both of okay, y'all. Look, and okay. I said it. Okay, that's hard. Said, we need it. these platforms. But the difference is we have the DJ element as far as the scratching. Wait, wait, wait. Don't, don't fucking give them the ingredients to the oh, sauce. Don't give man. them the ingredients? Okay. Don't get them. But, but we, focus on, <laughs> we focus on the bars. If they can see it, they can see it. Hey, we focus on the bars. We at the, the end of the day, shout out to LA we focus Lakers. on the bar. That's who I looked at and said, "Ooh." Yeah. So you didn't see his show and was like, "He doing a my, great job." I'm inspired by him. My inspiration yeah, was the LA Lick when he said, "This is what I want to do." Oh yeah, I did. Show I said, you that. "I said, man, the way LA Leak is doing it yeah, is I real dope." That, yeah. And if we want to be smart, when we need to look at them. Famous Animal TV? I've always known about Famous yeah, Animal. Known. So y'all but knew. It was, but what I showed him. But it was L.A. Leakers who I want to. When I came to him, I showed him Funk Flex. I showed him L.A. Leakers. What else I showed you? And uh, oh no, I, them the Sway two. in the morning. Sway, yeah. because he's the for my me was, vision. I knew <clears throat> to come to this guy, he could get the vision, for, for bring me, it to life. Do it was, you not it was think LA that Lakers. y'all have similarities to Famous Animal? TV? Of course. Yeah. What did he say when you asked him? Who? What did he say when he asked him? He didn't say nothing. He say he just he say he heard of him, but he well, we he ain't heard of somebody. Well, we ain't heard he say of him. He heard him because well, we ain't heard of him. We I'm ain't heard about him. him. I'm not talking about talking to you. I'm telling you, they he said he had done heard of you guys because somebody sent him that video. So what's of similar? Boosie. Uh, uh, daughter said, "Man, somebody did Joe. You know, doing like you. What do you did. think? The backdrop, or what do you think similar?" The backdrop. Because you got the way you be acting a fool. He acts act a, a fool. fool. Y'all both act a fool. There ain't no 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 but, line on that. But I'm saying everybody can't. And still, up. y'all both acting a fool. But do we you feel like, like? Do you feel like that's some? I feel you know how I am about Texas. I feel like that's a little hate when he said um when he came on this platform. He told you he said uh yeah I heard him. He just said like they some little niggas. He like, ain't said yeah, it in no bad you way. Can, you can bring that clip up. He has been doing said. it longer, so I'm not gonna sit there and act like he wasn't doing it before. It's just like hey, it no job who did it first. It before me. It ain't about who like, did it first. It's who did it best. Here's, somebody here's, got a here's what I'm Houston. saying. Hey. Y'all think Donnie Houston was he doing it before me? Hmm, done in Houston. Um, very close. Yeah, yeah, like, like, yeah, he was doing it for me. But yeah. see, here's you know here's the saying? thing, so though. Respect, he but. always been doing his thing, and I knew of him. Yeah. But when I seen it, I didn't be like, ooh, ah. Oh. When I seen L.A. Leakers, I was like, ooh, ah. Oh. I'm trying to fuck like I'm trying to get like these niggas. You know what I'm saying? I looked so, up the Funk Flex. I mean, at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? Cool. It was you know he do his thing, and you know, hey, he do his thing. Yeah, yeah. We, we need do all these thing. platforms in the south. Yeah. We need this. It's, it's, yeah. it's like this. When you go to the East Coast, when you're doing a promo run, when you go it's to a, it's a Hot 9-7, when you go to uh, the Breakfast Club, when you go to Willie and Gallo, Which, up, I mean, Willie, uh, Gilly and, 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 and Gallo up there in Philly, you go to Drink Champs in Miami, that's what artists got to do down here. You can go to Famous. You can go to you go to Boss Talk. No, you, can't. Yeah. No, you can't just go to Boss Talk. I mean, I'm just saying, when you're doing a promo <laughs> run, we won't, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, but, hey, even with us, everybody can't yeah, yeah. come up we here. We live on that motto. We listening to everybody. We're not just taking niggas' money, neither. That's another thing. We ain't also, just taking ain't, niggas' money. This ain't a live performance. You can't just bring your single up no. there and play it and rap over it. Same single that the motherfucker been promoting for. Hey, you got to bring bars up here. We rap on bars. You gonna get laughed we rap on anyway. multiple Y'all beats. Y'all ever heard of Timo? It's T- different. Is it Timo? The guy I had on here from Waco? <clears throat> He, uh, loved rap. he was on Sway and everything. I right? heard about him. You got to get him on him. there. Y'all got to get him I on there. I heard about him. Yeah, I reached out to him. I reached out to him. Hey, we been to Waco. Yeah, I reached out he to him. He didn't say nothing. He kind of, he oh, wasn't too hyped up. Hey, we been to Waco, it. and uh, Waco got to redeem itself. Yeah, we got to redeem, I think. <laughs> Waco got to redeem it. We been out there, and then, you know, made a blank trip. Sometimes when we travel, it's a great showing. Sometimes when we travel, it's not a great showing. And you know, Waco got to redeem y'all self, for real. Well, <laughs> we know it's some hitters out there. You probably like who did y'all. Nah, I don't y'all probably no work names. with the radio station or something. I mean, I ain't going to say you no names, but you know, because that'll gotta, be throwing them under the bus. I'm more, but. I, you know, like, it, it's definitely, everybody definitely can't come up here. You know, I get that, you know, because we, 
he knows I've never charged anybody so at right. all. So you definitely he can't paid come up me, here. but yeah. he ain't charged. Ain't we never, said, listen, yeah, to we just cashed our check. Everybody, you see what I'm saying? I just don't want. I, I won't. I, I really, you know, I, it's, and it's not a bad thing. It's just a respect thing, you know. Yeah. Like, like, like it's something I gotta want to do. Same thing right. with you. You do it, like, yeah. like you know how it is when you're trying to do yeah, your. Yeah. Sometimes the money don't some, even be worth. It. He called me complaining. Uh, yeah, I do. He he, he make me not never want to do it. <laughs> and he be like, email. Oh, no, it's the business part of it though, because everybody don't respect everything is a business. Did y'all get that at first? Like when y'all when y'all first started doing it, you know, like how far is the business? Like did people start coming or was they kind of hesitant? We wasn't we didn't charge for a very long yeah, time. It, was, it took us a minute. You had to be invited. You know, yeah, we that's got, what I'm you had to yeah. be invited. People we were nah, fans that's of, and that's how we built our but platform. I'm thank, saying, I'm saying thank not you like to people think like Little Flip. First, our first guest was Little Flip and Mr. Lucci. Facts. So we started. Dallas, with, I'm, saying, I'm saying not legendary like, niggas. Not like I'm saying far as the business, like the people. Come, want to come fuck with you know how like you know how people be hesitant like I don't know they platform ain't big enough you know what I'm saying I don't want to come think me and him been in the business for so long like hit, hit the break in Texas broke a lot of artists you know what I'm saying that platform was huge it was on a radio station this mm -hmm. was on the radio FM and you know me personally I've you know as far as signing artists to Exotic Pop doing a big extra plug drink Doing the yellow beezy drink, you know, doing. Cause we gotta get into that. You, the, the exotic pop. Yeah, we can that, go on yeah, and on. We, yeah, that. like that. That was that's some. Roll run, Simo. Shout out to him. Like that's something that that separate from. Is it the same umbrella or that something you got going, Pre? Yeah, or that's, you is that separate? He is a co-owner of that company. Okay, I'm, not I don't you. Got nothing to so do with you it. just threw that in there. You can't just throw. Let me ask the question. Well, I'm this just, ain't your damn show. <laughs> When you know he what I'm said, like, I'm trying business. to ask this man about the DJ part of it and stuff. Y'all done took it something. Y'all doing totally different. Y'all wrong, like, my nigga. As far as the background. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to get this part in. I got to clip this shit, man. Hey. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but that's, man, you know, we both got different relationships with different artists. Okay. That's, well, what, that's what helped the show grow the most. So was did, our relationships. Well, who have, I mean, the relationship that you had. Uh, he radio Mike station, one of the top DJs, you know. On you my see what I'm head, saying, I'm my nigga? This nigga won't shut up. <laughs> yeah. That's why, man, how you do it, bro? How the hell you, you do it, You know why? Because hey, you quiet. Because no, because nah, I don't be talking no, like this. Listen, I done carry, carry, carry platforms by myself to greatness. So you like, let now that nigga I got him to, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Let him be out here just happy to be everybody drinking. Go on, do that shit, man. This nigga out here doing this, and you gonna feel like, yo, nigga. Cool, dog, do your shit. Out. Do your thing, what's, what's man. The, what's the, what was the first time you seen rap economics? That was the one. Like was I, 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 I see, no, I seen the other. I seen some before, but that's the one I paid attention to. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna say what was the first thing that, that that popped out to you? That damn gray backing with the right, rap economics. I'm Thank trying to find you. out who that is. You Thank know what it was with me? What? When I seen Prez on there, just. That, I didn't know who this fool was. I'm like, that nigga crazy. I ain't really focused. I was like, it's a nice platform, really, to be honest with you. Yeah, and it shows because it. the Thank people you. follow it, the yeah. people look at it, they Thank rock you. with it. And, and this nigga right here, you know, he gonna put me up on game. You tried to call me one time and it didn't hit right. I told you that. You didn't know nothing about it. Didn't have nothing to do with you because about that little company he got. He messed the whole thing up with that damn company he got and the way it would look. But we not gonna go into detail. Yeah. But it was some stuff went on. He didn't know it was even happening, but I explained it to him, and he was like, damn, I didn't even know. You knew, because you was with me. You know? Damn. But, hey. <laughs> did you even tell him? Probably not. I, tell you, I probably I did. Know, probably did. Mean, we talk so we much. We talk every yeah. day, like well, 10, 12 times. What I'm saying times. is, bro, like, you have to be a special individual to deal with this <laughs> crook. <laughs> hey, <laughs> <you know? laughs> he ain't no crook, man. He ain't no crook. <laughs> No, nah, but I love his I love energy, it. man. Yeah, but, fun. but the first time he talked to me, I was like, no, no, yeah. no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga called me with him on the phone and we went in. Yeah. Hey, but this is my guy. He done made thing. us go viral. Same thing for you. Yeah, shout out to Trill Talk, times. man. This is, yeah, he I ain't gonna, always, I ain't gonna lie. Trill Talk, Trill Talk and Rap Economics been mutually beneficial to each other. Oh, it's, yeah. it's been great. Yeah, I love for real. For I love it's it. been that's how I rocked with you because I got to go with it when he tell me. This is what we doing is kind of like that's what we doing. You we, know what I'm saying? We we went viral 
three, four dozen times, a few times off of his posts. Yeah. Right. And he re- Will might only get 30, 40,000. He'll post it and get 100, 200, 300. Mm-hmm. Like, yes, sir. He posted the B King and B King reposted, reposted his. his. Yeah. yeah. Wow. B King, oh, yeah. that's my boy. He come through. Oh, so, yeah. Uh, Speaking of the beat, King. Man, you got Mike Jones. Boy, you know how hard that is, man. Congratulate Ooh. to you, dog. For real. Mike Jones, Boy. y'all. Y'all really, I Boy. ain't seen him in Houston you, lately. You know how hard yeah, it is hard. to get Mike he Jones, Jones in Houston. He was Boston. Yeah, oh, I want to get Who? Mm. <laughs> Who? Who? No, <laughs> man, you, do you know how much, <laughs> because of the way he marketed himself, do you know how much power he has? He possesses that same power when it comes down to his fan base. Mm-hmm. The biggest thing I notice about a lot of the guys mm-hmm. that people give up on, they fans never give up on them. Right. Mm-hmm. It can be people talking, chat in the background, nah, because most saying all this stuff head. about mm-hmm. them, and, and they are not trying to hear that. They love the music, they love that person. Yeah. 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 Most people back there, they had an organic following, though. They, they actually went out hand in hand. Like Mike right. Jones, them soul CDs, you had they went and deal with fans. A lot of these new rappers, they don't deal with it's people like that. It's different. They That's had a hand in hand combat. That was all we had. Do you think, like, like when you look at the music scene, uh, you got. I mentioned you guys. Uh, some of the guys. What was that guy I mentioned earlier? Uh, my wife knew his name. The Hispanic guy with GMB. I don't know his name. Uh, Mexican OT. And then the other boy, the other Hispanic guy. That, D-Baby. You D-Baby. hear about these guys more than anybody else right now in Houston when it come down to what I'm hearing. Right. Mm-hmm. Is there anything I'm missing? Oh, you. It's that, a that's lot. like that's on the level of that they're on because I'm hearing about on them. On the level. You know right what I'm saying? Now, you understand what I'm saying? Right I say quiet that money. Quiet money died. Yeah, quiet die. money died. You know, it's on the bubble up. This is, you know, they the hottest right now, but you got a lot of artists that- So they are the hottest, so I'm hearing right. D-Baby and OT? Yeah. Yeah, right now. Two yeah. two of the hottest things of the, running out of, of the H-Town. Hottest, Absolutely. Of the hottest. I was hearing Lil Jeremy at first. Absolutely, yeah. Before Lil them. Before, yeah. before Jeremy I saw, was having a great run. You see what I'm saying? I'm just Jeremy, telling. we need you I'm, on I'm, the show. I'm listening. He you was know having a fantastic run. How- I remember I say this when I, I I took this one artist right, and y'all all know him, but when I took him, I got so many calls from him. He already had a following, but more than so many people called me from different states and went in my in my DM and say, I, when I put Hot Boy West on here, mm-hmm. people say that's how they figured out who he was as a mm-hmm. person and start tapping yeah, into yeah. it. I'm being real. Like, but I that started was one getting of the first all these damn calls, man. I've met him yeah. before. He's good, good, good. But he got man. that he got that grit, that that street, that, yeah. that, that, that he got. You that. can tell he a real mud, baby. Like, he really, he really from. But like, he really tell. humble and really got manners. And I met him, and he was I real like Hot Boy West. I so I he do. locked up right now. Free yeah, yeah. Free, like free Hot Boy West. Yeah, we was looking for him in Waco, for sure. So that's what I'm saying, like, like, who is this that you guys have had like that type of impact where, cause people don't know people, like right, till they come and sit on a platform sometime. They might've heard their music. Oh, we've had some but artists. But they never heard their, car, their, their, their character. We, uh, you might have Quiet. artists. Quiet Money died is one who broke out after being on the platform. He broke out after. Mm-hmm. Brittany Renee. Brittany Renee another another one who, who Yeah, y'all got really a plaque with her. Y'all got a plaque. Yeah, yeah she, plaque with we her. did 10 million with her. She brought us a plaque. Brittany Renee really broke out after yeah. the platform. Oh man, let's think. Who else? He was out? already hot, but my boy GGO Kurt. On yeah, yeah. yeah. GGO Kurt yeah, East broke Texas. out after the East platform. Texas. He absolutely nine did. Zero three nine three six. Uh, I'm hearing something. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Uh, we had a few breakouts. Uh, shout out to my boy. Um, man, we done had a lot. A few breakouts. Damn, we done had a lot. We done yes. did over how many artists? We done did. You think? Man, I don't. I don't even try over to count them no out. I don't even try to count. Getting close to four hundred, but I mean, you you could understand putting out Say content Diddy. five to seven days every day since we started. You know, we run through them, dog. Like, and I'd be out of state a lot. Yeah. If it's, you could have one Texas artist right now, come on, rap economics. Who would you pick? Oh shit! That you ain't had. That I haven't that's had. That's tough, bro. That's tough. You, get? you that's just tough. you only get one. That's tough. That's tough. Like you that's do the three, they only get one. Let's not do that. I'm gonna pick two. That's. Two Texas artists that we haven't had. I'm gonna I'm gonna say the name. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> These are gonna be two opinions, probably. Yeah, two separate yeah. opinions. These two He's, separate yeah. opinions. Yeah. 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 These yeah. are your yeah. words. I, I, no, it's easy. This I want Meg the Stallion and Big X the Plug. That's what I you thought want. about that. That's, that's what you two want. Two Texas artists that we haven't had. We're gonna keep working till we get there too. Watch. <laughs> what about Who you two? want? Shit. Damn, bro. I need four. 
Give yeah. me two. Give me two. I need Dallas. I need a Bun Dallas B. list. I need a Houston list. Bun B. I need a PA list. Big Tuck. Big Big Tuck. Tom Tom. I need Kiki. Kiki. I need Kiki. Sauce Walker. That's it. That's it right there. Kiki and Sauce Walker. That's, that's who you, who you need. That, that's I need it. Slim. Nah, that's it, bro. Slim thug, I need Killer Colleon. Killer Colleon. I need Killer Colleon. Y'all name it, nigga. Y'all, that's why yeah, you gotta give him two. Give him two. They said three or four. That's what I said. Yeah. Like, yeah. you gotta give him two that you want. I started bro. with two, but we need a lot, dog. Man, we, we need. Man, but I think yours will be the hardest. You gotta think. H-Town, man. Megan, Big X. Big X, I love to hear that nigga. Oh, y'all love to hear that nigga. That nigga voice. He been on here. That nigga voice. I'm such a Big X fan. It's so great to find young artists to be a fan of, being my age and shit. That shit is great, dog. I'm, a, I'm a Big dog. X fan. I, you did the drink, didn't you? Yeah, I did a drink with Big X early on. So, Brought him in so, so it should be easy pop. to get him on there. It shouldn't be hard. Yeah, got it. You know, he doing it. He yeah, moving yeah, around yeah, right yeah, now, yeah, but yeah, you know. Yeah, should, shouldn't is a world that with, to, shouldn't yeah. is a world with fairies in it, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, let me ask shit. you about, about, about the drink now, though. Like, how did you end up in the, dabbling into that part of the business? Um, uh, This is exotic. Um, exotic pop. Exotic, exotic pop. pop. I mean, what is what does it entail? How many flavors is it? Who all is a part of it? Ooh. You niggas got a lot of people over there. We got Y'all, a lot. it's a bunch. That's why I really I had an issue with it. Cause I'm like, I don't want to be just a number. I want to be something special. Right. So I, I like give me a special diamond or something on it. I don't want no cup. I want diamond to sit on the counter or something. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. So Charleston started Exotic Pop. I was his bank. I used to work in the bank. Who was that? I don't know him. You yep. don't know him. The, the, from the, H-Town the number yeah, one Charleston the what? number one dude at Exotic Charleston Pop. Wilson Charleston Wilson okay. you got Ke- uh, Keelan for the real Charleston but um <laughs> said real Charleston <laughs> but a, is that a joke nope <laughs> you don't know nope. <laughs> I worked in a bank uh back <laughs> when he was crazy <laughs> <laughs> you don't <know. laughs> no <laughs> go ahead <laughs> he said it you <laughs> tear his ass up you nope <laughs> nope that's an H H-Town Thing. That ain't got nothing to do with what's funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> nope. <laughs> but no, I worked in a bank. He was doing vending machines at the time. You know, I was his banker. So every time he'd come to a transaction, he'd tell me about, you know, different ideas or whatnot. And we just built a relationship on from that. And, you know, we've been rocking, you yeah. know, from storage to stores to, you know, we got bringing in different people. You know, it's just been 100. Yeah. And, and, and like, how many. How many would you say that people got cups? Like, like got got drinks. Yeah, it's a lot. Drinks, cups. Different regions, you know. You know it's all over. How how many? How many? What's the biggest one? Shit, international, man. DJ Screw. That's the biggest one. That's my man. That's a, I know why that nigga. DJ old. Screw. What made y'all charge like like, you know, like the DJ Screw one ain't cheap. None of them cheap. Yeah, I'm not. But I'm saying like some of them like you had to. What was it, Soldier Boy? He was charging what, like fifty dollars for one. You had Travis Scott. Well, we sold that for a hundred dollars at Astro World, and they bought it. Yeah, he bought it. How many y'all made? But it came with a shirt. It came with different. So it was a bundle. It was Makes a sense. box. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But yeah, you know. Shit. In the wrong business. You know the yeah, culture. We, we gonna figure it out. You know, oh, I, got, I got a throw little collection at the highs, you man. Do? Oh, my collection cold, boy. So you say? I think you told me that Lil Flip is a part of it too. Right, right. Yeah. Lil Flip's yep, one of yep. the owners. Yeah. Like, 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 how, how is that? How you got him on rap economics first? We definitely got a relationship. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we Flip. both got relationships. Yeah, I mean, we both. We, that's my guy. I mean, that's that's my. When that's, I told, that's, I hey, I that's told why the show I, worked because yeah. of the. That's why and I worked. Flip went what thirty minutes? Man, he did. Flip went for an hour. Oh, 60 minute oh, and it, it, off and the it dome. wasn't it wasn't 60 minutes of garbage either didn't he gave you bars really yeah didn't fall off man I've been a flip fan for a long time I couldn't get him on boss talk dropped on crit as a matter of fact I tried, to, talk I tried to, to get him on boss talk I reached out no, we I mean, that was know, our it, debut it really, video. If I start to name minutes. the names that you yeah. know, people who show love YouTube, and culture to yeah. Boss Talk, you're right. Be honest, Trill Talk. We got a lot of names. We ain't I ain't name dropping, but it's a lot of people. And I ain't gonna lie, it was a lot of people. I man, when t- when Tip and this man were going against each other, man, you know, I have resentments. Now after you didn't get on here, I got like thirty pictures of Tip on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> look at him, just look back. T I T I T I. I was mad because Lil Flip won't come on Boss Talk. Everywhere, maybe we can put some Flip up there. I go I Bun mean, B up there. 
I'm you always know? I'm always gonna be home team yeah, first. Always, get, I was home team. Always, yeah. I tried. <laughs> we <laughs> gotta ride with the flip. I, but it, you want me to tell my story? Yeah, I always come tell on. it. I want to hear. Okay, the deal is like if you trying to go with a woman, my mama and them. If I was trying to go with a girl, she cheating on it, going with everybody else but me. What do you think my mama gonna say? You need to leave that girl alone. Yeah. She don't want your ass. Yeah. Okay, it's the same thing when you think yeah. about some trying to get somebody. Reaching that flip, I'm reaching, reaching, flip. reaching at I don't everybody. think you went through the right channel. That's I'm it. I'm gonna just say, man. That no, I, I don't hear. But I you know, but you know, that right could channel. be true because people go through the wrong channel trying flip. to get on boss talk a lot. Yeah, mm -hmm. people go through the wrong channel trying to get to us too. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. So Definitely. I, 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 all I know is I know the word got back to me. It, it got to his ear, and I heard a lot of stuff. I I hear from him. So, yeah. but at the end of the day, man, we just a podcast, man. That's it. Me and my wife, you didn't watch the show. Y'all been in here. Yeah. It's for the culture. We're gonna see what's it's yeah, for the culture, man. Like like I said, and 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 there, it's a lot of good people out there, you know, look Kiki, propane. Mm. Mm. You know what I'm saying? These boys, I got you know, J Dog, that's that's mm -hmm. the home mm. team, you know. Like you you gotta realize when you're dealing with this thing, man, it's about our people and our culture, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Our children. Mm -hmm. You've heard me talk about children, cause I do that. But right. that's what it's really about. It ain't about us. It's about the children. It's about the. It's always about the next generation. Right. So it ain't really even about us no more. We had our time. Mm -hmm. Now we got to do something to impact our children. I just told these other guys that was on the panel. Who have you brought up? Who you? And it's silence. Wow, we tried. No, well, <laughs> evidently we ain't trying hard enough. <laughs> you got everybody rocking with you when you come out. The lights pop on. Ah, all the people on the sign. Can I get a picture? And you. All you gotta do is say, hey man, do this, do that. That's all I'm saying. I'm gonna yeah. continue to say that. And and we that, gotta help people, man. Right. That's what we love about Houston. It's so much talent. The people y'all see on these videos, that ain't even necessarily who the streets is listening to or who's the best rappers. That's what rap economics, that's what birthed this rap economics thing. Skills. There's so many rappers in them crevices that's hard. Skills. They got fan bases. They not on the radio. They don't know social media. They hard though. Why y'all Why y'all keep everybody split apart? What you Houston, mean? Houston don't really, I, I, I'm, I think I'm the only one. You remember I did that show when I first started this? And I brought Houston, Dallas, and I brought East Texas up there. You mm. remember that? Mm. I had all three of them performing in the same place, bro. Together. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, when you think of Houston, it's like a bubble. I know the prison system doing it. I know the damn football team's doing it for sure. You know what I'm saying? Mm. It causes a, a divide. You know what I'm saying? Because we're so proud of our people and our team. But, nigga, we Texas, man. When Big X did that song, we from Texas. That's loud. Think about it. Mm -hmm. It's so powerful because... When he talk about PMC and when he talk about the Houston and the Dallas and bring all that collective together, I think that's so live, bro. I think as far as, and I don't want to just, but rap economics, when it comes to Texas, when you look at when you look at our show, you got Brittany Renee from Port Arthur. You got Get Money Lil Ronnie from Fort Worth. You got... GGO Kirk from Nacogdoches. You got Trap Boy Freddy Trap Boy from, from Oak Cliff. Yeah, so y'all making that bridge. We bridging I mean, that we, gap. We everywhere you got you got Parts and Ivy, Boosie daughter. Yeah, Smoothie. Yeah. Texarkana. Texarkana Smoothie. TK Barbie. I mean, Texarkana. We, you know, try we, to make them we respect Texas. I like that. We from Houston, and we gonna. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm a always put on for my yeah. motherfucking yeah. city. You should, sure. but. Rap economics is bigger than just Houston. Yeah, it's we, about it's about the South. It's yeah. about the Gulf Coast. We had little Soldier Slim from New Orleans. He called me and told me he was right. going yeah. on there. That's like my, <laughs> yeah. my people, bro. So yeah, like he called, right he always got he yeah. come here. He well we rock hard. You know? Yeah, we me and him rock rock. Yeah. You know, I was he took me through New Orleans. Yeah, when we did the Soldier Slim soda. Yeah, I went hung out with him. Went to different restaurants. He got his hair cut downtown. You know how they be getting their hair cut downtown sitting? We really, he showed he me New Orleans. He yeah. told me. Yeah. 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 He showed me New Orleans for and real. I, yeah, and, and I could go tit for tat with you because we also be down there. Mm -hmm. Get it? Hear me? <laughs> Interviewing and uh, in, the, in the staple communities. In right. the, you know what I'm saying? We also be down there. I mean, you know, but I'm older, so I'm really, you know, I'm hanging mm -hmm. with KL and, you know, just just trying to figure out a way to try to bridge the gaps. I get a lot. I do a lot of Louisiana, bro. You know who I want to see you up here? Mac. 
He Mac had. already done it. He, he done been, been up here? He came when he first came He one came of my out. favorite artists. I did it already. You watch the show, bro. I know. He one of, <laughs> hey, you he one of my favorite. Man, listen, man. <laughs> that's why in college, that's why I listen yeah, to right. Mac. I watched the show, yeah. I've been hey, watching. my freshman year in college, I listened to Mac. You're a bad dude. He like a down south Nas. Yeah, yeah. I like I like him a lot, you know. I listen you to seen that. the one I one did with Silk? I seen the silk. I seen you should have seen, seen the Mac the one because I always ride them in each other. I seen <laughs> the ice tea. I seen the ice tea one. I seen the KLC. I love the KLC one. Yeah, yeah. Man, it's I watched yeah, it. Shout out to you while you be serve on. You be doing you your thing, one? dog. Mm -hmm. You be doing your thing. I'm yeah. working. Like, what's yeah. the next big thing for y'all? <sighs> man, okay, we got more travel coming. Mm -hmm. love, we got, do you like to travel? Yeah, absolutely. Me too. Fucking love it. Yeah, people dude. really oh love it God. too. They it's love it. You know, it's different when you leave the city and it is. Yeah. They show you love. What? Man. Just being you ain't one of them people. It's a blessing. What? Yeah, it is. Yeah, that's from Houston. It ain't really never left Houston. Nah, I love it. Nah, nah, I'm saying that ain't never left. Like, nah, nah. Yeah, I'm coming to East Texas. But um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been East Texas, but, um, yeah, yeah. Yeah, been been Texas, yeah. but we got more travel coming. So we got more dates coming to your city. We do one down there. We got live events coming. We got music reviews coming. We got ciphers coming. We got distribution coming. A lot. We got singles coming. Wow. Man, it's this. I got a 15 year plan. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? We in year. We still in year one of a 15 year plan, right? We now. ain't even so, hit one year yet. We did all this. Yeah, we're not a year old. Seven, wow. eight months. So how many subscribers y'all got? Nine thousand. Almost. Almost at ten. Almost at ten. ten in less than in a year. One year. It ain't been a year. year. It ain't been a year. It'll be a year in November. Yeah, November. If you to, if you look by to do. if you look by you know I think October 31st. We posted our first video on YouTube, our intro. Hey, how y'all doing? We're here. Finna take over the world. Yeah, That actually, was October yeah. 31st. And but that wasn't an actual video. We didn't post our first video till December 25th. Damn. Which was flip. Which was the little flip Christmas special. Mm -hmm. And that's when we started our YouTube journey. Mm -hmm. And you know, we um we almost at 10K. By the time this come out, yeah. we might be at 10K. Like and shout out Quad Money Dot. He shot an actual music video on our set. And made yeah. it his... You know, one is you'll like why that you you'll like him. Oh, really? he, he keeps the culture. Cause he like hey, a, he, oh, man. he a real Texas. Hey, like when he, you when you go, when you come to Houston and you riding down MLK, you can listen to his music. You gonna hear that's what you gonna hear the, the yeah. niggas jamming in the slab. You know, you, you gonna got, hear Quiet Money. You know, die. you got Big X, bitch. I'm from Texas. Yeah, Quiet Money Dot just put out an H Town that. version with the same <laughs> feel. Like, oh, this yeah. some Texas shit right here. I'm so Texas. Yeah, it ain't big on Instagram and nothing like you ain't gonna hear on the radio, but. When I you sure would like to see Big X do a remix with like different parts of people. That would be dope. Ooh, that'd be that hard. would be dope. Ooh, that'd be hard. That would be dope. Cause it'll help. It, it just it brings us more together, man. With everybody on the OGs, the young ones, everything. Well, you can do two or three versions. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That, that's why. Or he could do like Kiki did to Cypher. That would be dope. Man, Kiki a dope dude, man. I, I tell him that yeah, all the Kiki, time. He, like, that was hard. When you bring people together like he that, gonna, man. he will be on the show very soon. Oh well, he already been on my show, but I'm. <laughs> 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 hey, shout out! Let me shout out! Let me shout out! <laughs> nah, he good, Pete. Let me yeah, shout man. out Sauce Will winning and uh, Sauce Walker, man, for they really connect them dots in Texas. Now, I have never they had, do a lot I of did Sauce Will winning, but I ain't never had Sauce Walker on, on Boss Talk. Oh, well, you know, I've had Sauce Walker. Y'all did? <laughs> I have. Oh, that's hard. I'm talking about you. <laughs> we had Will winning. We working on Sauce. <laughs> yeah, he but that's definitely get. somebody to pull these strings in Texas. I thought he would have came salute. to see me. I've been had this store here for 17 years. I thought they say he liked black, like the black business owners and stuff. Nah, he's 17 doing. years not yeah, enough? Yeah. Nah, he gonna Damn, come. how much I got to do? I got to do 25 yeah, years? Like I told Carlos when they came down here, hell, y'all got everybody else on there, hey? <laughs> I know damn well I'm supposed to been, been on that thing. Look how many years? I done had five, six, <laughs> stuff. I, I know my husband. My nigga right gonna tell the yeah, truth about time. that. It been here forever, bro. Oh, it's all gonna come together. So all I'm saying is, I put that work in. I know on what it's about. On a whole other level. For yeah. the... For the for the community, mm -hmm. for the pe for our people, bro. Right, for right. The people, that's what this was about. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's nice to provide something for the people that the people appreciate, right? And they look forward and to seeing more the of. But I ain't gonna lie, I got y'all, so I be forgetting about other niggas. Once God showed me this is what I said, I listened to it. Mm. Y'all gotta catch that. You gotta think nah, about that. Shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, that shit. like you huh. can't, you can't really, you can't really question when God say yes. And when God say no. Yeah, yeah. So I'm cool yeah. with the, yeah, we I got to real hit, talk, no pill talk. Hey, we had to hit that high what? Man, when I appreciate y'all, We had man. to hit the high, we had to yeah, hit the high. Yeah, it's big for me, like, this big. You told him, I, I yeah, tried to big. leave you one thing, here. I told y'all to leave. Do, yeah, you can't leave me, I didn't know you even watch it, man. I said it left him. It's one thing they didn't do. It's one thing they didn't do. What they didn't do? 
They should have brought us a trail burger. Woo! But you ain't lying. We gonna, we gonna hit him down the street, but I just was talking to him. Best there. burger in the country. So you think the trail burger is the best burger in the country? Best burger in the country. What makes it? My boy over there put so his good? head down. He like nah, I ain't gonna speak on the. I agree. Anymore. No, I agree. What make, it, what make it so good? Like explain hey, it to me. Explain. It's it. thin, but you get two patties. I'm gonna say like the edges. Crispy. You know what? It, you know what it tastes like. It tastes like somebody was in their backyard grilling, and they didn't burn it. They almost did, but they didn't burn it. It's crispy. The cheese melted on there. This nigga really You know what I'm saying? He done made, a, he done made me hey, one. Got, no, but he like, got this nigga over doing commercial. I went. <laughs> hey, hey. They didn't burn it. They didn't burn we didn't, it. We didn't get I got it right here. It's just crispy. I'm going to send this to Buzz. Hey, that's what I know that hey. nigga for real when he start talking like that. I went. When it, when it uh, the grand opening, I done been like five times since the grand opening. <laughs> five, six times. Nigga, you, you know how open. hot it is. Waited in line. He didn't get you out the line. We was in line. <clears throat> and you in that whole like. You gotta be. Waiting. Hey, you gotta be Drake to skip Happy. that line now, nah, man. Oh, yes, really? it's going down. You gotta down. be Drake to skip I'm that trill line. I'm trill talk, no pill talk. I should eat a trill burger. I should Good be able to skip the line. <laughs> Good luck, my brother. <laughs> <laughs> I waited in that line and was happy. I ain't gonna do it when take I got my it. kids and let them stand in line. When he get up to the front, I'm gonna tell him all the burgers. It ain't always in line. You just gotta go at the right time. It ain't hey, always in line. That burger is most good. of it is. <laughs> we had got the. Uh, about, y'all got, that's what y'all do down there at you, the rodeo. But you gotta understand, you know, you got the, the Breakfast Club down oh, there. Yeah, we used to wait. You got turkey leg hut, turkey, turkey leg hut, trail burger. I've seen people just standing outside now everywhere. Now we got, now we got big got chicken. Plate. Man, I love Houston. When we got the best the food. We got big chicken now, from Shaq. I ain't saying it's the best food. We got food. the best food in the country. East Texas probably that, got the best food in the country. You can, you, yeah. I'm gonna say right. Texas. They, I'm gonna say Texas as a whole. As far as restaurants, we do though. Yeah, but I'm talking about just food. Oh yeah, just food. I'm gonna tell you this: all them folks from Louisiana think they can beat Texas. Nah, y'all, y'all can't rock. You know what I'm saying? You just over there making challenges because I rock with Louisiana. All no, Louisiana's day. good, but I don't really. But like it's better here in Texas. Put my wife, I'm not really like that. Now, I'm, I'm, you I'm, eat oxtails and Jamaican food a lot. Hell now. yeah, that's I'm married to a Jamaican. What you think? <laughs> yeah. Shit, I'm eating uh, curry chicken and all that. Yeah, yeah. go to the butt. I don't eat no goat. Oh, ah, okay. I will try some goat. You know what I'm saying? That's funny. You know what I'm saying? I will try some. I ain't gonna lie. That's funny. So I'm East Texas. I'll try some. You know, we'll try some. Yeah. Like, like, so you guys, what what do y'all see this thing going, man, for as rap economics? What what do you guys would like to see at the end of the the end of the rainbow? You wanna go first? Uh, this platform, I just see it growing into so many different avenues. Like I said, we just had somebody do a whole music video. They based the video off of the show. Damn. It was like we was DJ Khaled. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We the best type shit. You know, it's so many different lanes. I feel like we gonna go. Wow. Man, what about you, DJ Nightcap? Man, what you see right now like I said, is the beginning of a 15-year plan. You heard of Complex Media, mm. you heard of Def Jam, mm. and you heard of Distro Kid, mm. motherfucking rap economics, mm. nigga. Wow, that's I'm telling all. You, you see, like this it. the merch, the merch on the website right now. I'm telling you. you. see the merch. RapEconomicsOfficial.com. Shameless plug. <laughs> so how they reach out on everything? Rap Economics. You, you it reach us through the all social media, right. Rap 101 Economics. Yeah. Find us on the website, Rap Economics Official. Mm -hmm. Wow, man. Like I said, man, you guys are something else, man. Like, I'd like to see you guys keep going, man. And, and I'm definitely here for you if you need anything. Boss Talk 101, you know, Trill Talk, no Pill Talk for sure. We in the building. Like I said, I don't really just post a lot just yet. It's coming, though. Mm -hmm. But I'm just letting it build up. Cause yeah, yeah. You know, when we do it, it's going to be something different, you know. Yeah. I'm really just trying to figure out a way. I, I, I would like to do some things, but it got to be in a big way. We got to push up. I, I always tell them that. We right. got to push our information up. Everybody push their information down on us. Mm -hmm. You look at the West Coast and the East Coast, they push the information down. You wake up and do 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 You watch TMZ. You, I'm, I'm on Vlad. I'm on World Star. We got to start pushing up. We got to start pushing. No. I don't rock with Vlad, dog. I rock with Boss Talk. Fuck that nigga Vlad. No, I don't oh, say that. I say it for me. I yeah. rock with I Boss heard Talk. It, man. Boss, yeah, talk, it is boss what it talk is. over Vlad every day of the it week. Is what it is. Man, I appreciate that. Real man. talk. But, I'm going to say it. That got to be the first clip you put out. Yeah, yeah. Hit that, that nigga <laughs> yeah. I got to get you a shirt immediately. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we need, yeah, we need merch for sure. 
but but no, I, I definitely just say, man, we gotta we gotta push up. We gotta get this mm-hmm. information. People don't. I always tell Trill Talk like they don't mention us in no top five or nothing. They be just they put Scarface at the bottom of that list. Y'all don't be seeing that. Do that when they did that yeah, top that don't make y'all feel twenty-five no list, they put fifty. The the top fifty, and then they did one, they did yeah. one with the groups. And I think UGK you, was down there like number 20 or something. I yeah. said, what the fuck? That's what I'm telling the you. The fuck? They, they don't they, respect the side. That's why they push it down. Yeah, they don't and respect the side. And we got to do something to push it up. They don't respect the third coast. I think the most important thing is that we build a structure to where, where they will be able to land. People will land on it and it look a way to where people want to stay on it and get their information there. Shit, we're mm-hmm. we going to bring the Am industry. Right? We're going to bring the industry back to Texas. Yeah, yeah. we're going to bring it back. We're going to bring the industry back to Texas. I think we can. Absolutely. I really do. It's just the, the platform that changed now. We create our own narratives. We just, we got Triz on no pill talk. He putting out more media than everybody. He get the story Man. first. You know what I'm saying? He's hey, one of the key so elements. I, I'm not going to lie. That's why I salute to both of y'all because, and I know he gets a lot of knowledge from you. It's time where I call other. him. I call him all times of the night for advice on different things. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, How we to do, do the same this. thing. Yeah, it's, we all do that. Yeah, we always trying to figure it out. And like I said, the main thing for me, my main objective, is to make sure that people understand what has happened here mm-hmm. uh, with Bun B, with Scarface, with Pimp C, with uh, all of the different people, with Erica Badu. She get her national exposure, but it still ain't nothing like getting it from where you're from. Right. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. DOC, even though, you know, all of these people that really come from here, you know what I'm saying? When you start looking at, you know, all the DJ screws, all this stuff, man, we got to figure out a way to make it look a way to where people can land on it and respect it. Yeah, That's the most important thing. I don't think mm-hmm. we've done that yet as a people. And we have the resources. Right. But we got to have self-love. Yeah, That's the most important thing, self-awareness and self-love and not... I know you want to be like humble, but you got to, and I know you, I, I shouldn't even say that, <laughs> but at the I end of humble, the day, <laughs> I know you want to, but, but we got to start pushing our way in to say, no, nah, this is who we are. Mm-hmm. And we did have that happen. A lot of time we, we second putting ourselves over to the side out of respect. Yeah. When we really misguiding the whole situation of who we are. Mm-hmm. Well, you understand what I'm saying? Absolutely. You can't do that, man. Cause there's some people out here that love what we do. Mike Jones, y'all just mentioned him earlier, man. There's some people you heard them niggas. How they uh, what that little was it the little loser first said, man. Mike Jones, yeah, was, like yeah, mm-hmm. my biggest. He ain't the only yeah. one. It's been a bunch of them that's been coming out saying this is what made them who that's they fine. are, bro. Mm-hmm. And then you, I know you got pissed off when I posted that about GD when GD when they were talking about Master P and them like that. Yeah, I don't because they be hating on the <laughs> Like, you know, people be just talking, man, and they don't really show us that love a lot of times, so we gotta figure out a way to show us that love a lot yeah. of times. I've been trying to do that my whole career, dog. That's, what, that's my, why we rock, that's why you like My whole entire Boston. career, yeah. My, that's, that, that's it every, right there. Every platform I've had was about the scythe and trying to mm-hmm. take things to another level. Like, that media can be this media, right here for us, about us, you yeah. know what I'm saying? I've, yeah. been, I've been trying to do that my whole career. Because a lot of DJs don't break music. They might DJ and they play with Everybody else is playing, but he actually wants to be the first to play music a lot of times. I think that's hard because you You got a lot of times people don't do that. They want to wait till you get hot. That's right. Right. That's what they want to do. And that's hor- that's horrible, actually, because at the end of the day, you 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 just riding away. Riding away. You don't really mm-hmm. care about the people. If you catch them before they get hot, everybody else going to see that. And everybody else coming up next, go know. I got to go fuck with Nightcap if I want to get hot. Now is I gotta go fuck with rap economics. I gotta go fuck with boss talk. You know what I'm saying? Trill talk, you, no peel talk. Gotta, gotta get posted by Trill talk if you want to get hot. Now that's what we are. You know what I'm saying? I so think, I, I think that's the whole game, man. Like I said, I gotta start. We gonna start doing some things to put more exposure on what we got going. You do a great job, man. Like mm-hmm. like people respect you. Dallas, Houston, yeah, everybody Trill respect talk. that. Trill that, talk that, be doing this. They thing respect the hustle, way. man. They can't do nothing but. But I always <laughs> tell them that, like. The information that he provide and the way that he do it, I always tell him, like, ain't nobody doing that. I don't even listen to nobody else, to be boy, honest with you. That boy posted some of our content with the other day and called this motherfucker trash. And it was probably some one of the best things that could have yeah. happened to him. Yeah, uh, because, I swear to God. Because a lot of times people see that it ain't, ain't what you do, it's how you do it. Like, I had posted a dude from, uh, he a pimp dude from, uh, from D-Town. Mm-hmm. But, like, he was rapping on it, and I was like, I understand what he's saying and it's going hard, but I was like, he was like, how can we get it? How can we make a jump? I said, man, 
I'm finna do something, but he gotta ride with it. He gotta understand what I'm doing. He he was cool with it. I put on there, I said, is this the worst rap, rap economics freestyle? Because I know, for one, if you say that, they're gonna go look at it. Because it's trash. Even though you say it's trash, it's trash, they're gonna go look at it to make sure. And they look at it like, the whole comment is like, damn, he really went out. Everybody yeah, like, went out. Boy had a they thousand comments defending, defending that shit. You know what I'm saying? Genius, man. I'm genius. fucking genius. Listen, that's he know what genius. he doing. Oh, that's true. Yeah, talk. I like fucking with Trill Talk. Figure it out. Yeah. yeah. I like fucking be, with Trill Talk. Now, you can't trust everything because you had y'all throw that damn water. Your ass can get caught up. Don't get too caught up in this, man. That nigga got some stuff over there you might not want to play with. <laughs> but at but the end of the day, I think it works, man. And, and I think. Our unity is more powerful than a ton yeah, of I love the camaraderie. I, I know if I go to East Texas, you know, oh. we good. Yep. Yeah. I mean, you know, we yeah. call check in with him. We know Damn good. Hey, where to be, where not to be. Yeah. Who was So you believe what? in the check in process. It ain't, it ain't really it's check in. <laughs> Fucking we don't right. call it checking in, we call yeah, it hospitality. I, I call it checking in and I believe in it. I believe in it. Fucking <laughs> <Yeah>. what? <laughs> hey homie, I'm in your hood. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me where I need but to I be, I where I'm not hospitality. need to be. Yeah. Yeah. You got a banger you can let me hold. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Bring a couple partners, tell them to meet me over here. Cause I don't know who's who. I believe in that shit. If you a G. OGs yeah. who you know. I guess I'm an OG not at my age but yeah, the way I was raised you check called. the fuck I in man I, before you we walk, came here you don't walk to somebody house called. without speaking your mama you taught called. you that right I made some phone calls before that's called came hospitality up you yeah, don't walk exactly. to somebody yeah. house without saying hey y'all exactly. how y'all doing huh? why just it's just hey I'm in town fucking yeah. right hey what you got going fucking right I call low D's that's my boy. I call you him. You already know who you talk yeah. to. I call him. Hood fame Lil Ryan. I call a lot that of boy's cats. A, that boy's a politician for yeah, real. Yeah, he ain't that telling me. I call Solo Lucci. I call a lot of cats. Oh, that 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 right matter fact, matter of fact, fact, he ran for public office before. That boy's yeah, a politician for real. How you lose, though? I mean, City Council, wasn't it? City you ain't, you ain't face loss. We almost I You ain't scar face loss. But he ran, though. That's did you the point. Did you run the same time? This is before face. Did you vote for face? Yeah, yeah. Do y'all think this, these, these ballots are, uh, I mean, what is these electoral votes now? Yeah, they fixed. Yeah. Well, no. no, this is the thing. The district, because he ran in the same district I ran in. It's hard 80% to get of the vote population in that district is 65 or older. So he's still, he's still young. You know, he still got yeah, a little. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was young, young. You know what I'm saying? They were looking at you probably like, yeah, fuck yeah. It, you got to be older. You know, the young people still not voting in the South like that. Yeah. It's an older thing. That's, that's about to be You got to be like 60, 70. You know what I'm saying? That's who votes. To win. Man, y'all please go vote, man. That shit matters, <laughs> especially locally, dog. Yeah. It's, more importantly, locally, fuck the president. Go vote on yeah, your mayors and city council. This nigga here is wild. <laughs> yeah, uh, that nigga say whatever though. He, <laughs> hey, he didn't told him to go vote and when you go to the town, check in and get a pistol from him. Same subject. He said all in the same sense, man. That's crazy. Shout out to shout out to I ain't gonna lie. Shout out to you know Houston. Shout out to our mayor. Done a lot for the city, Sylvester Turner. Shout out to Sylvester Turner. Uh, Sheila Jackson Lee. Rocking with Sheila. Y'all mayor, Sheila. I, I took pictures with y'all mayor one day. Man, I, hey, I've known Sylvester Turner for a long time. Yeah. Come out the phone for man. Yeah. Yeah. That's that, my boy, that, that, man. That nigga, that be dancing and that's everything. That's my boy, dog. We're going to have another heated. black mayor. Yeah, oh, Sheila. You, in the future. You, nah, Sheila, Sheila Jackson, Sheila Jackson Lee. Lee. She, oh, she good? We behind her, absolutely. Yeah, she about to, she about to we run. behind her. Wow, that's hard. So y'all gonna keep, he getting out? He his turn. I mean, his turn. Yeah, yeah. it's a turn thing. Yeah. Wow, wow. Pretty, yeah. Well, man, how, like I said, anything you guys need, I, I know we about to get to the end of this thing. Like, um, I hope we covered everything. You know, I always welcome. You know, if y'all trying to push something to come through and talk about it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, once I lock in with you, I'm locked in with you for life. I want you to I check do. in with him. Well, you got to check in with me, but you definitely <laughs> don't check in with me because I might be out of time. I'm a I'm a check in. <laughs> You I be like, on, yeah, you be at it. I like making. It, I like making it back home to my kids. I'm checking the fuck in with everybody. Yeah, I'm, I'm checking in. <laughs> but if you checking in over here, you coming straight here and hey. chilling with me. Because all that other stuff. My. No, I can make some calls around the city. Mm -hmm. But everybody ride yeah, with me. Yeah, you can. Yeah, I don't okay. go everywhere. I get invited to a lot of stuff, and I I, I be like, I ah, I pass. So a lot of people be trying to get me to come out, but like I'm an old man. I ain't trying to do too much. I'm not hanging out with you and standing around. I can't do it. I had to call him to get motivation and care. He like, go on, go, man. <laughs> go on, go, man. I'm like, man, you think I ought to go to this, man? Yeah, you need to go. Because I'll be, I'll be just trying to figure out how 
you know, the, the electronic thing is real for me. That's mm -hmm. what I really specialize in. Mm -hmm. So that's what I really be trying to figure out because that part got to be, we in a world where we driven by, by mm -hmm. you know yeah. what I mean? Data and all this, we got to figure yeah. that part out, bro. Yeah. But that's where our kids at. They stuck on that thing all day long. Yeah, we definitely. are too. Definitely. Everybody is, so we got to figure it out. That's why you did rap economics. Mm -hmm. You make a difference because you in that, you, that's, that's real estate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. it's Absolutely. Just in a different way. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Mental yeah. real estate, which yeah. is way better. Yes, it is. Attention. <laughs> right. Attention. We fighting for attention out here. We selling. We selling attention. We making money off attention. That's real. Absolutely. Your nightcap, man. Prayers, man. Thank you guys for coming on the show, man. Thank you, man. Like I said, man, you guys are always invited back. Um, hope you guys keep watching. We get mm -hmm. me and my wife and, and Money Moses. We gonna continue to go you know and push and try to figure out ways to get everybody you know what i'm saying get everybody to the show we we, we gonna do some more traveling trail talk say you gonna go when you never go man, he started it. off kicking man. it with me but he kind of mm -hmm. like i ain't go man, but he hurt his in. arm so hey now that i'm here man everybody need to go follow unique fashions man they got some thold ass got clothes some, on oh here, man, man. And, for and, real, you know what dog. this show this thing been here forever you know i ain't gonna lie to you man we've served a lot of people bro man it's, it's, Shout it's, out it's to nice Fat and some more people they always came here for years i hate to sound like an old nigga but they got some fine threads, my ah, brother. That's hard. They got some that's fine like threads, you, man. my brother. <laughs> man, man, shout out to Mike Jones. He coming in and bought me out when he come. He ain't playing no games about it, man. Yeah. He got a shopping pride. Can't wait to get him back on the show. Mike, yeah. Mike come cool. holler at us, Mike. Come holler at us, Mike come Jones. Us, man. Man. I got you used to the feelings you in the building. Come really holler at us, dog. Man, thank you guys, man. Hey, Trill Talk, man. It's been another great segment of Boss Talk 101 with a boss's talk. Trill Talk, Thanks. no pill talk. Hey.